Hello, it's Jason Payne with JDP Realty, a coal banker, Dean Harper Realtors. Well, I'm still out at the West Wind Summit section of Alamo Ranch in the northwest part of San Antonio, and we're going to be looking at a Chesmar home behind us, built in 2014. It is almost 3,300 square feet. Let's go check it out. Now, I do have out-of-state buyers looking to buy in this subdivision. One of the reasons is, is it's only 20 minutes from Lackland Air Force Base. It's a beautiful gated subdivision, lots of beautiful homes, well-kept lawns, quite a few military and first responders live in this community. Let's go check out this home built by Chesmar, one of my favorite builders. All right, before we go in, I wanna point out some of the little additions they put on here. Like they have extended the driveway a little bit. I really like that a lot. And if you see this little wall right in front of me, that is to hide your trash can so the HOA folks don't give you a hard time about it. And this whole concrete pathway, that is all added on by a previous owner of this house. So that is really kind of neat. They extended the driveway on this side too. So you do get a little extras. Kind of one of the benefits of buying a pre-existing home is, well, some people have already done some nice work for you. Really nice landscaping with a rock wall around it. All right, let's head on inside. You do have a front porch sitting space. Does have a ring doorbell and a nice big door. Right when you come in, you see the tray ceiling that Chesmar's put into it and some little nooks in the wall. Perfect place for hanging a really nice painting. You do have a formal dining room section. Dig in the arches. There's a little storage closet. Come around the corner. You have a full bathroom, perfect if you have a guest staying in this front guest bedroom. With lots of windows and a good size closet. Let's check out the main space. They do have tile and wood combination floor, but check out this kitchen. I kind of dig the high layer cabinet there for putting real stools on it. Dark cabinets already has the hardware put on it. Neat little backsplash. Got the pendant lighting. Beautiful uh, faucet and the stainless steel 50-50 sink. You're watching my videos, you know how I feel about 50-50 sinks. It is a gas community. They do have the oven down low and the microwave built into the cabinets. But wow, look at the detail on these cabinets. That's really nice. your walkway into your main dining room area. The garage is a really deep garage. That is long. See the little lip in front of me right there? That's kind of where you want your car, but then you have all this extra spot with a water softener. And if you're from out of state and watching these videos, our water sources are Mostly from an aquifer. Oh, it's been cleaned up or repainted. Are uh, from an aquifer, so we do have pretty hard water. So having a water softener in this part of Texas is quite important. Uh, it looks like I forgot to turn a few lights on. So you have a, a breakfast nook area over here to go on top of your formal dining room, your utility room, which is a really good size one. A 
love the fact they put the rock inside the house too. All right, for those of you who have sensitive eyes, put some sunglasses on because bam, look at the colors of these walls. Yeah, luckily paint is cheap. Maybe they didn't want the walls to get hit by a car so they put reflective wall paint on here. Good God. Hey, we all make choices in life, but this choice you can be painted over. Not to put my opinion on things too much, let you guys form your own, but it's 99% universal that, yeah, that's special. Maybe the parents lost a bet with their kids and the kids got to do it. Choose the color that is. But you do have a really nice bathroom that can be shared by those these two bedrooms. Once again, they got the arches. Like I said, here we go with the neon green and the blue. Overall, it's in really good shape. Can have a few holes to patch, but I have a pretty good idea that the new buyers will be painting these rooms. All right, let's go and head upstairs because we do have uh, upstairs loft area and one more bedroom. Before we go see the owner suite. All right, this is a really good size bonus room. Looks like there can be some touch up paint being done or somebody tried to do some touch-up paint, but didn't realize you have to use the same color and the same sheen. So yeah, this wall needs to be repainted along with that wall, but paint's pretty cheap. Some touch-up needs to be done on this baseboard as well. But a uh, few of neighbors. I, I will go outside before we, all right. Got to hit these lights in this because there's a full bathroom up here. And another full walk in closet. This is perfect if you've got that teenager, or well, nowadays that 30 year old who won't move out of your house, they can live up here. But you better charge them rent, that's for damn sure because they wouldn't want to be leaving if they had this space up here. And this giving you access to, if I can hit the light, if I can find it, and I can't. Okay, they hid the light on me, but You've got your access here. It looks like they've already got a bunch of plywood down. So you have your additional storage. Maybe, nope, not, oh, there it is right in front of me. There we go. So lots of additional storage in this house. Chessmark does a hell of a job of framing up a house. So this is really good looking. Not a construction person. So my realtor eye, it looks good. I'm not. Not an expert, but man, that looks really nice. Okay. All right, let's head on back downstairs and check out the backyard and the owner suite. All right, we're gonna head out to the backyard. Just give another look at the kitchen. That's pretty cool. But what's also pretty cool, they got an outdoor fireplace built into this house. Now, I haven't mentioned price yet. This house was built in 2014 and is listed for 
415. So not a bad price for this house. I definitely expect multiple offers on it. I got to this listing earlier and there was three different uh, agents bringing their groups by. So you will be seeing your neighbors a little bit, but it looks like you only have good visibility of one of them. So yeah, get to know them. And this extra sidewalk that went all the way around, that's really nice. You do have a gas hook up here if you want to have um, your grill. Well, it's kind of a tight spot for a grill, but you can do it. All right, let's go inside and check out the owner suite. Good sized owner suite with the tray ceiling. French doors leading into the bathroom. Two different vanities, both of them framed. You've got your nice soaking tub right in the corner and a really good sized walk-in shower. Well, good size stand up shower with a shelf. A little bit of a step, but the mud inset, really nicely done. The other vanity. And then closet with three layers. So you do have your off season shirt you can put up there. Trying to see if there's another closet. If not, that's a little bit of a small closet. And yeah, that's gonna be linen and water closet. So yeah, closet's a little small. I didn't see another one. Alright, just in case I missed it, I want to make sure I do show off where they have this study. So I can't remember if I got distracted by the beautiful kitchen and I didn't turn left. But this is a really good size study. Great light in here. And it can be considered a bedroom because it's got a closet. That's kind of the rule. If it got a if it has a closet, it can be said bedroom but the French doors makes it look more like a study. So you really can do whatever you want to with this room. All right, that's gonna wrap up this beautiful home built by Chesmar in 2014 in the Alamo Ranch area on the Northwest part of San Antonio. For my clients who are thinking about putting an offer on this house, let me know. We do need to move fast because we're on day two and usually by day three, that's when people are accepting one of the multiple offers. For everybody else watching this video, make sure you like and subscribe. And if you are looking for a real estate agent to relocate to this part of Texas, let me know. I'm here to help. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now. Bye.